Hello, my gorgeous water signs, and welcome to your weekly energy check-in reading. We are just going to jump right in and get started. We did have a couple of jumpers today. We had the Hermit in the upright, Two of Swords in the reverse, Three of Wands in the upright, and the Star. What this is kind of telling me is I feel like either you or someone you're dealing with has come out of a Hermit, a Hermit, a time of thought and illumination and has made a decision which direction they want to go in. I do feel like the direction they're wishing to go in is the one of the wish. I do feel like you might be that wish. Or flip it, this is you heading towards your person. Um, I do feel like somebody took the time that they needed to really see very clearly why they were choosing what they were choosing for themselves. They feel like a ship would be coming in uh, to port when it comes to you. I feel like they feel that you would be the right choice and there could be great abundance that comes with this choice. I really love that. So, um, all right, let's hop in and see what else Spirit has to say for you gorgeous water signs. All right, ooh, four of wands, that stability, that union. Oh, you guys have great energy. Okay, so we have the soulmates, the sweetness, the love. I do see a tether. Um, I feel like, I feel like in the past, there was some level of defeat in this situation. Um, but I feel like the tether between these two soulmates is so strong. And I feel like between you and this person, I feel like you both have this want to nurture this situation. Look at that. We've got that King of Cups in reverse. So that's speaking that truth in love. Um, really, you know, face to face saying what one feels. And I feel like that may be entirely necessary in this situation, especially if we have this 10 of swords in reverse in the past. Um, you know, obviously it was tougher to get going. I feel like neither of you want to wait over this situation anymore. And it does seem like someone is putting in the action effort. Yeah because they want that two of cups. I love it. I could stop it right here, but I feel like we'll, we'll, dig, we'll dig in a little more. Um, you could have someone really special coming in this week or your next seven days. Um, I feel like this is someone that doesn't really even have to compete when it comes to um, who else is around. I feel like this person or you collective are the clear you know, the clear winner when it comes to who they want to choose. I feel like they're hoping that it's a little easier to get things together um, this time around. Oh, wow. We have the Hierophant. So we want a commitment. Um, this person may want to take it all the way um, or may have plans to take it all the way. Um, and I feel like they're hoping that that works out. I feel like that is the intention. So we have the Knight of Swords here. This person could be rushing in very, very soon. Um, rushing in, speaking a truth, or I hear letting it all tumble out of their mouth. So yeah, look, it's taken a lot of strength for this person to, um, I hear persevere, or there could have been a reason why this person couldn't have gotten to you sooner, um, or you getting to this person sooner. Um, but I feel like there is ultimately going to be that happiness. And I feel like this is happiness is kind of kind of as high as it can go. Yeah, somebody's taking that action-oriented energy and stepping towards you. Um, I feel like this emperor that's coming in, they may have withheld their feelings for quite a while. I feel like, you know, they still do come in a touch armored. So... You know, that's something to take note of. I do feel like this person, once they figure out that you are a soft place to land, I feel like the armor armor will fall away. Um, I hear to the wayside. So, or they 
keep this, I hear, don the armor. So they keep this armor on during their days out in the everyday world. And then when they come back towards you, I feel like they'll be able to drop it at the door, which I really love. I feel like um, they see you as being that soft place to land, that comfortable person they can confide in, whether it's good, bad, or in between, they know that you're there and that you've got them. And I feel like that's the energy and I feel like that's the reason why. I feel like this person sees that with clarity. Um, that's no secret that they can lean on you. Um, they can, you know, toss ideas at you. They can have great conversations with you. I feel like it's on all levels. There's romance, there's passion, there's friendship, there's love, there's sweetness. It's like there's all of those key factors. I feel like this person, this emperor, whether masculine or feminine, is looking at you and knowing that you tick all their boxes. Um, and I feel like, therefore, they're ready to just, yeah, they want justice in this situation. They're ready to speak that truth. Um, this could have been a past situation. I feel like the past of this situation could be something so simple as it never got off the ground. Um, or it could be deeper for others. But I feel like, yeah, I feel like for whatever reason, there wasn't a victory in this situation in the past. Um, yeah, but they want to rebirth this from every end is a new begin again. And I feel like they want to start over. Yeah. Um, I, I kind of heard no small offers. I feel like this person's going to offer you it all, like right off the bat. I feel like they're going to say, look, um, I know what I want. I feel like this emperor just clearly knows what they want. Um, they want the opportunity to take it further. They know how they want to kind of proceed into the future with you. So I wouldn't be surprised if they tell you right off the bat that their intentions are to take it here or there. Yeah, they want to plant that seed with you. There's no need to go off in search of what would fulfill an emotional cup because they already know it lies with you. Now they want to give, they could have been giving to someone else in the past or to others. It could have been a job. It could have been um, family. It could have been friends. You know, I feel like maybe it was off balance that they weren't giving to you maybe when they should have or could have. Um, but I feel like now they're looking to give to this. Um, I feel like if there were other people involved, that would come out and they would clearly um, let you know what had happened there. I feel like they want to be very transparent with you. Yeah, this person wants to build with you. I really love it. I feel like great energy, water signs. This could be you or someone you're dealing with. Um, there is the devil in reverse. This could be a person that was involved or um, toxic habits that were involved. Um, but I feel like it's past because we've got it in reverse. I feel like those chains have been, um, I hear, relinquished. So... Uh, I feel like maybe in the past, this person was seeing through the eyes of fear and they couldn't quite see maybe what you were offering or if what you were offering was going to be good for them or if it was the truth of what they were seeing. I feel like they couldn't trust their own eyes maybe in the past because of um, looking through the eyes of fear. Um, everything was a little frightening. So I feel like that could have been a reason um, right there why they might not have stepped forward. I feel like it's coming though. Yeah, look, sleepless nights in the past. Okay, I love it. I feel like you've got someone good coming in. Someone that really wants something with you. Or this could be you, either way. But um, gorgeous energy. Really looks to be um, good energy for the next seven days. All right, for the water signs. Let's see. Your initials, their initials. We've got O's and zeros and a D rolling away. That could be somebody there. Let's see. I want to get just a little more. That A is on the outskirts here. I don't know why. That could be a sign for someone. All right. Let's see. I, I, okay. I just said X on the outskirts, and I see another X with an A. Um, yeah. I, I don't know. Somebody may have an X with an A. First or last name, or both, first and last name. All right, let's see. Just heard the name Lo or Loey. I 
I am seeing Cancerian energy here, which doesn't surprise me in a water sign read. <laughs> I, I see, um, I saw the B and I saw B-O-I, um, so boy, but I don't know if somebody uses that as a nickname, but um, could be someone you're dealing with. Or in the past, this person could have been um, uh, hopping and bopping around to different beds. Um, maybe there's been some growth there, I feel like, been a lot of growth maybe. All right. Okay, we have a you that was stuck to me. Somebody stuck to me. Somebody stuck to you. Okay, Y to a O E. I wanted to say zero, so I don't know. L six nine one I. All right, all right. What else do we have? Oh wow! Hold on one moment. We had a few come out, so we'll leave this there for a second. What else do we have for the water signs? All right, <laughs> we have the Eiffel Tower standing up. Um, some of you could be taking a trip. Oh, wow. Okay, so I did channel a message yesterday and I never did get it out. So it's just one of those ones that sits in my little file there. Um, but it was in a collective that I was doing for yesterday. Um, someone may be traveling to see a lover I was getting a message about please be careful as far as um, intimacy with this person. I don't know if they're keeping it a secret that they have some sort of um, issue going on. Uh, I do hear transmitted diseases. So um, if you're going to visit someone and you're looking to be intimate with them, um, do ask questions. Uh, ask those uncomfortable questions and also um, use protection um, because they might not tell you the truth, okay? And I, I was getting that and now it's kind of coming back around. Um, so this is more of a warning. If you're going on a vacation or you're going to stay with someone, um, just be very careful. I, I am hearing sexually transmitted diseases and sexually transmitted demons, which is also another energetic thing. Uh, so yeah. Okay, we're going to keep going. Just as a word of warning, word to the wise. Um, we do have peace here. I hear pour yourself up a cup of tea and a, and a bit of peace. So I don't know if maybe you'll be spending time with someone who, um, within the next seven days who kind of brings you peace. They just kind of... Oh, maybe, okay. Um, I did see someone sitting listening with headphones on, so I don't know if you're maybe listening to the person that you care about. Um, they could have a platform, they could talk on different topics, or um, they could be a tarot reader, don't have to be, of course. Um, they could talk about anything, but I kind of feel like maybe that's your way to relax, or it's your way of relaxing with this person, or collective flip it not collective water signs flip it this could be someone that um sits with uh and listens to you um so you may have your own platform and they may sit and listen to you and they find peace doing that it's like something that they like to try and make part of their day or part of their week and i feel like this person might actually be a little bummed out if you don't post or if you don't um, so I don't know. It could be like pictures and somebody trying to keep up with your life. I feel like this is somebody who's not quite there yet. Um, I feel like you'll know soon. I, I did kind of see this as a maraca. So I feel like this person might be making a little noise soon. They might be telling you how kind of wrapped up they get in. I wanted to say your podcast. So some of you might have a podcast. Um, I hear general topics. So you may have a podcast where you talk about general topics um, and somebody might really just enjoy your energy. Um, it's like their way to relax and unwind is to kind of sit with you in your energy. I really love that. I feel like that might be a really healthy thing. Um, they see you as being very unique. 
yeah, look, again, we find that peace. We find that peace. I feel like your peace or the peace that you offer um, helps this person move forward, helps them feel like they're standing in their power, and they also recognize that you are standing in your power. Um, there could be a love offer very soon, and I feel like there's a shyness when I kind of touch that. There's a shy energy that kind of comes along with it and a very sweet energy. So the person coming towards you could be shy or flip it. You could be the one that's shy going towards your person um, with a really sweet little love offer. I feel like you're going to be confessing or they're going to be confessing how much they really enjoy your energy and um, maybe what you do and the fact that you're so unique. I feel like that really stands out to this person. I really love this. I feel like all in all, really great. There was that little warning, just be careful. Um, um, and it doesn't have to be traveling uh, to see a new person. This could just be, uh, I don't know, if you're out and you meet someone, um, just, just be really careful, okay? Um, maybe you're traveling to go see someone. You might have not have to travel far, but that person could be um, conveniently not telling you about something very important and potentially dangerous to you, okay? Um, so careful, careful. Um, the warnings don't always come through and they're not there for fear or to inspire fear, only to keep you in the know. If it comes through, I'm gonna report on it. Okay, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, friends, bye.